Hi, I'm meteorologist Chris Kuiper in the Fox 26 Weather Center, and it's been a breezy afternoon here in the San Joaquin Valley, but it's been a downright windy day in the Sierra Nevada. Those winds in the higher elevations of the Sierra Nevada are doing something a little bit interesting. They're creating a nearly stationary cloud up there. Here, let me show you what I'm talking about. Looking at a 12-hour time lapse here from a camera located in the Inyo Mountains, and you can see the Sierra Nevada Mountains in the back. On the far left, I believe, is Mount Whitney in there somewhere, and uh, Mount Williamson, another 14,000 foot peak is in there. So see, these are some of the high peaks of the Sierra Nevada. You see off in the distance there. And notice now towards the center of your screen that one cloud just kind of hanging tough and continuing to stabilize and stay in that one spot. You see clouds up above it at a higher level in the atmosphere floating overhead just fine. But this is what we call a standing wave cloud. This one cloud that's just standing pat and not moving. We're getting the air coming over the Sierra Nevada, bouncing down a little bit. And then as it bounces back up, that's creating that standing wave cloud. And this just stays put for hours and hours hours and hours at a time. It doesn't create any uh, rain or anything like that, but it is a sign of turbulence in the atmosphere. It's something pilots are certainly going to look for and notice, and they're going to try to avoid that area because they're not going to see recognize that the air is somewhat unstable and it's moving around a whole bunch. It certainly could make for a very bumpy flight if they happen to go over that. Uh, looking at it on a satellite picture, it's going to look a little bit like this. You can see on the backside of the Sierra Nevada, early in the day, kind of quiet. And then notice those clouds just really developing there behind the Sierra Nevada as the wind goes over the Sierra Nevada and then it kind of drops down a little bit and then it forces back up somewhat. Uh, you can see it graphically if we look at it this way. You can see the air kind of coming towards the Sierra Nevada, moving up over the Sierra Nevada, and then it drops back down a little bit. And then that second bouncing back up there, kind of a hydraulic jump there, if you will, uh, that is creating that standing wave cloud, which is a tight of lenticular cloud and that's well, just a signal of uh, turbulence in the atmosphere and kind of interesting to look at on a satellite image.